Welcome to this week's edition of K-Time Seminole Baseball fans. I'm Scott Kodak inside here at Hauser Stadium. The Knolls are coming off a nine-game winning streak and take that into Raleigh this weekend to take on NC State. So that gets us, of course, to our first storyline. It's just how overall important this weekend really is, not just in the ACC standings, not just in the Atlantic standings on our side, but how important this is for national seeding when we approach the postseason. NC State's in the top 10, top 12, 15, depending on whichever poll you look at, the Seminoles are firmly in the top 10 as well. Talk about RPI, talk about how good these two teams are. This weekend is crucial should the Seminoles earn a national seed. Should the Seminoles lose this series, that national seed starts looking less and less likely. That's why this weekend is so important. Remember, NC State split a series with number one ranked North Carolina just a few weeks ago. They didn't get to play that third game, but still, NC State's been playing awfully good baseball. The Seminoles are going to have to continue that hot streak. The road has frankly not been kind to the Seminoles so far this season. This weekend should provide quite a good test for this young ball club. Your second storyline is the NC State ace and Carlos Rodon. We got to take a look at that young man last year when he came into Hauser Stadium. An awesome performance. Seminoles got to him early, but Rodon was really able to settle down later in the ball game. He's having an unbelievable season, may be the very best pitcher in the entire Atlantic Coast Conference. Big challenge for the Seminoles this weekend. And your third and final storyline is the number 36. And anybody knows anything about Florida State baseball, that number is big. 36 consecutive seasons of 40 plus wins. I just want you to take a step back and realize how big that is. A lot of college baseball teams don't get to 40 wins, period, for 10 to 15 se seasons. The Seminoles have done it for 36 consecutive seasons, and really the season's not over. There's still a lot more ball games the Seminoles can win, obviously starting with this weekend. But congratulations to Florida State. 36 years of 40 wins, that's an awfully great accomplishment. Seminoles travel up to Raleigh, they'll head up Friday, play Saturday at noon. Remember that series is Saturday, Sunday, Monday, with that finale being on ESPNU on Monday evening. So here at Hauser Stadium, I'm Scott Kodak for Seminoles.com.